The federal government has ordered the disbandment of the National Tax Force on the prohibition of illegal importation of arms, ammunition, light weapons, chemical weapons, and pipeline vandalism. That was one of the decisions reached during the National Security Council meeting chaired by President Muhammad Buhari in the council chambers of the presidential villa. TVC News senior correspondent Femi Akonde reports. The National Security Council has wielded a big stick against the National Task Force and declared it an illegal security outfit. This is the second time President Buhari's administration will be declaring this same security outfit illegal and ordering it to end its operations. This will likely stall the 2022 establishment bill for the National Commission against the proliferation of small arms and light weapons passed by the Senate in July. The presidency ordered the National Task Force to disband itself or risk possibly being disbanded. Equally of concern is the presence of some illegal outfits that impersonate the legitimate and security agencies. Of particular concern is a body called National Task Force on illegal importation of goods, small arms, and what have you, but the short name for it is not force. We, the, the council declares that body an illegal organization. It should just simply disband itself because we, I mean, the council has ordered all security agencies to enforce the disbandment. But in 2013, there was a court judgment against the disbandment of NAT force by the federal government. The National Security Council also appraised the security situation in the country and acknowledged an improvement in the performance of security agencies. As ordered by the chairman of the council, the president, I wish I have said to all Nigerians before now, that we will put essentially most of the challenges of uh, banditry particularly, insurgency, kidnapping for ransom, criminalities of that nature far, far behind us. Uh, we, are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are equally pleased with the performance of the Nigeria police. This noticeable improvement in the overall security situation in the country confirms the declaration from the Minister of Information and Culture that the worst is over. The decline in insecurity could also be a result of President Buhari's orders to security chiefs to stop the attacks and killings by non-state actors across the country. Femi Akonde, TVC News, Abuja.